Okay, Drayton Park, part two, if you like. So the road at the end where that man's just cycling up the street from, it's a tiny little road. It looks like he should have some hovis hanging off the back of his bike, doesn't he? Um, that of the road is Drayton Park, that was my last post. And this is Whistler Street. And then, can you see the little, follow the man on the bike? And we're going to go and walk this way. And it is, really cute little street I mean it's hard to believe that we are actually sort of a stone's throw from Holloway or Arsenal Stadium and all these things but these one can assume were built as um, workers cottages as I mentioned in my last post lots of people working on the railway land and lots of small businesses in the area so where you've got the huge great houses of Highbury Park and the one the big terraces all around um, Highbury Fields, um, this is in contrast. So perhaps an awful lot of the people that worked in this street here might have actually been working in some of the larger houses through here. So this is the little alleyway that cuts through between the houses in this street. uphill. One wonders if it might have had a little river thrown through here or something, isn't it? It's odd. And you can see at the end there, the trees that you can see. That's Highbury Fields at the end and what you're actually looking at there is the enclosed sports areas. So that's really nice and I'd recommend you come for a walk through here. Also you might notice as you walk up this road, um, there are some really nice tiles, uh, tiles around some of the doorways in this street. Um, all different and all extremely random. As if someone had a bucket load of different leftovers and just went crazy. So recommend that you do come and have a look. Okay, see you soon.